In this video, we will learn how to solve three-dimensional vectors algebraically. This is a simple topic here. You have been given the vectors, the component forms of vector A, B and C. You have to do scalar multiplication with, by ve scalar multiplication of vector A by 6. This minus 7 is multiplied with B and so on. So you can directly take a calculator and start multiplying them directly instead of writing it out. So everything is multiplied by 6 here. It will be minus 30 and then we will have minus 24 and lastly there is 18. That is the first component that is 6a. Then plus just multiply this minus sign inside. It will be minus 42 minus 14 minus sorry this minus and minus becomes plus. Even over here, minus and minus becomes plus 49. And then lastly, we have A to be multiplied. It is going to be negative 16, 16 and 32. So these are the answers. But this is not the simplified one. Then you need to add all the X terms, Y terms and Z terms. Here you will have 30, 72, 82, 88. Minus 88 is the first component. Same thing you need to do for the others. Over here we have 2030, it will be positive 6 and lastly we have 49 plus 32 that is 81, 91, 99. So that is the answers, answer for the first one. Same way please do it for the others. Just use a calculator and multiply, that's it. Even over here, here it's simpler because there's only 7 times A minus 5B. Do it up and then you will get the answers. So this is how we do these. And same thing over here, the same values are there. And now over here you can see they have given in terms of i, j and k. But the component form can be directly written over here. x component form is minus 9, the coefficients only 4 and 3. Then y is over here 6, minus 2, minus 7 and lastly z is minus 2, 2 and 4. Use the same method over here then, 7 times this entire all the terms plus 6 times the entire terms over here and add them up, you will get the answers. So this is how we basically solve these. Okay, now since they have given in terms of i, j, k, remember after you solve it up, write the x term as i, j and k. The coefficients, the answers will be the coefficients of i, j and k. The easiest of all. And that's it, everything is same.